Hey, yeah, you. Are you tired of throwing smokes like this? Or this? Well, today we're gonna teach you how to fix that. Welcome to TSM's Vertigo Smokes Guide for Counter-Strike 2. Vertigo is one of the most beloved maps among the CS community. Oh, baby, man. Not so much by the pros, though. The thing is, that with Vertigo, like, the map just it sucks. Now, shall we continue where you left off? Firstly, and most important, a site smokes. All these smokes are gonna be essential when taking a site from ramp. Perfect scenario would be if you and your friends smoke the site at the same time. But if you're solo, just make them drop you some smokes. When entering a ramp, position yourself in the corner of these sandbags. Look at where the edge of the scaffolding meets the metal construction and do a simple jump throw. Smoking the left side of the site will let your team freely attack from elevator and clear if someone's holding it. The second part of perfect A site execution is the right side smoke. This lineup combined with the left side smoke will shut down any players that are trying to contest the site after your team pushes. Line yourself up with the left side of the second stack of sandbags. Turn around and aim up at the second edge of the red scaffolding. Do a simple left click and you should have your right side smoke for the site. Smoking both sides of the site will completely isolate any players from coming to retake it, as well as any players that are already holding the site to begin with. And last but not least, the most important smoke on A site is the boost. This allows you to completely deny any CTs from peeking or scoring an easy frag on you during retake. Going back to A ramp, you will line yourself up with the second set of these yellow scaffolding pipes. Look up and find the top right corner of the red scaffolding structure. Aim at the edge of it and do a simple left click throw. This combined with both smokes for the site will guarantee you the round with complete isolation of any CTs trying to retake the site. Now that you've learned the perfect A execute, it should all look like this. Bonus lineup. For this particular video, we will show you how to molly elevator after you've smoked A site on Vertigo. Go to the first stack of sandbags, aim at the center of this circle, and right click jump your Molotov. You will have a perfect spread for elevator, pushing back any CTs holding it, and you can now freely move up to the position and isolate the CTs from any backup. With this full execute on A, you will have lots of winner winner chicken dinners. I hate these chickens. Taking mid control on Vertigo could be very useful to your lurkers or if your team is splitting a bomb site. Let me show you the two most popular ones for splitting A site and B site. The infamous heaven position on Vertigo is one of the most powerful ones on the whole map. All the top dogs know how to counter it, so it's about time you learn it as well. This is the most common spot for an op to hold mid and one of the hardest fights to win. So by not allowing CTs to push and contest your mid control, you can make the opper rotate and catch them off guard. At T-spawn, find this stack of sandbags and position yourself at the outside corner of it just where the blue bin is sticking out. Look up and aim at the bottom half of the first line on this ventilation. Once you do that, do a simple jump throw and you should have a perfect mid-window smoke. This will force the opper to either fall back or take a risky push through the smoke, making him an easy target for your team that's splitting A. Splitting B is one of the most common strats on Vertigo. This A entrance smoke will allow you to easily take mid control. This is a tricky smoke to land consistently, so you will need to practice it first. Once in mid, position yourself at the beginning of these metal slabs. Aim just left of where the two metal posts meet. Now, this is very important. You need to press the W key and left click simultaneously for it to work perfectly every time. This smoke fully covers the entrance to A, allowing your team to take control easily without worrying about an opera holding your push. Taking our business to the B site of Vertigo, you will find yourself getting headshotted from the site every time you try to push ramp without any utility. We'll show you how to completely isolate the headshot angle holding your push. From T-spawn, find the metal slab right behind the stairs. Position yourself in the right corner of it, look at the entrance to mid and find the second metal pipe on the wall. 
aim at the bottom of it and do a simple jump throw. Headshot smoke will give you a lot of freedom for you and your team to take B-Ramp and get into the site without instantly getting one tap. This smoke, combined with the next two, will give you complete control of the site. Okay, so you isolated the headshot player on B site. Great, now it's time to deny the retaking of any CTs coming to B from either mid or A site. In higher ELO, these smokes are the most essential and will decide the round. From T spawn, find the wooden slab right next to the stairs. Position yourself at the right side of it and aim at the top right corner of this wall. Once you do that, you can use a simple jump throw to land this smoke. We see these smokes being used in almost every pro match on Vertigo and is essential for taking B-Sight. Once you have the headshot smoke and the right side of Gen, it's only natural to smoke the left side so you have full control of the site. Coming to the B-Ramp, you will see this big box just next to the stairs. Place yourself near the left end of the box, Crouch down until you line up your crosshair with this dark line just beneath the black dot. Turn around, and while still crouching, look up at the corner where the metal slab and the wall meet. Then stand up and do a normal jump throw. Now that you have acquired all the stones for your Vertigo T-side smokes, it's time to show you some CT-side smokes that are just as powerful. Holding a site is one of the most difficult tasks for CTs on this map. Doing this smoke will stop any T's rushing A in their tracks. This gives CTs a lot of control over one of the most important parts of the map while leaving T's vulnerable to a flank. From CT spawn, you will go to the A entrance from mid. Position yourself on the left side of the wall and find the first point where the lines on the ceiling meet. Press and hold left click and start running. Once your crosshair meets the edge of the ceiling, throw your smoke. This will completely isolate T's at A ramp, leaving them with no choice but to go scaffolding where you can hold the choke with mollies or not. Using this smoke will deny T's from fast pushing mid and overrunning your opera holding the position. It will also create a lot of space, allowing you to control mid. Going back to CT spawn, go in this corner and aim on the line above the cables on the wall. Do a standard jump throw and the smoke will land perfectly every time. This ramp smoke will instantly deny T's entry onto B site and will give your team a big advantage while pushing B site with an op. Very useful if the T's are on eco and will likely rush B. You can just wait for them to push the smoke and get some easy eco frags. From the same spot in the CT spawn, shift your focus to the second metal slab from the wires on the wall. Look all the way up until the metal slab and pole meet and do a normal jump throw. <laughs> Having a counter to constant flash spamming on B is an excellent way to potentially win a round. If you're an A player, this B retake smoke will come in handy every time your team loses B, denying oppers and those little ratatouilles a comfortable spot in the post plant. For this retake smoke, position yourself right up against this orange construction fence. Place your crosshair right in the middle of these two metal pipes and do a normal left click throw. If you don't have a smoke, you can also use a flashbang that will blind all the T's standing on the side as well. Equally effective. Congratulations! You're now equipped to be a smoke machine on Vertigo. Impress your friends and confuse your enemies as you rise to become a global elite player. If you like this guide and want to see more, leave a like. What new smokes have you found on Counter-Strike 2? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.